one day temple at the bro. First trekking to the Brom temple from the north gate. Arrive early to beat the crowds. This temple showcased the power of nature. The giant tree have wrapped their roots around the ancient ruins, creating a beautiful blend of stone and greenery. You experience the sounds of birds and feel the cool morning breeze. Temple, we going to see a lot of tree. Enjoy the tree filming and tree shooting. Being alone, you also can enjoy relaxing here. Take about an hour to explore. Listen to the nature ambient and soaking in the atmosphere. King Jayavarman VII dedicated this temple to his mother, which adds a personal touch to its historical. Time for breakfast, even explorers need to eat. Take 30 minutes to relax and recharge. Try some local Cambodian noodles or stick to a classic croissant. Enjoy fresh fruit and juice for a healthy start. Sip a coffee or tea and take in the morning vibes. This break helps you refuel your mind and body before more temple adventures. Prasaptanai is the hidden temple in the area where not many people know. You can hear the quietness of this temple. It's so peaceful. You no need to get into the crowd, get into taking photo or video. And you can hear the music of the bird. In the forest, the unique about this place is no restoration at all. And you can enjoy better than other places. It's a sort of road drive to reach the Nai Temple. The temple is less crowded, offering an awesome tech experience. Minimal restoration allows you to see the ruins as they were found. Carvings, the feather, tell stories of Buddha's life. The setting is serene and magical, surrounded by nature. Perfect spot for quiet reflection and peace away from busy areas. Amazing. Never forget, come this place if you have more time. Time to switch things up with a little climbing. Lakao Temple, the temple older than Angkor Wat, were used the best quality stone for making this temple that have been a thousand years already but it still stands still. It's a beautiful uh, atmosphere that not many people did it and some people really adventure, they will go up there. It's the most finest stone that we ever use. Uh, here we also can find the green sandstone, but green sandstone is fragile. That's maybe one of the reasons why you don't see any carving. Takao Temple is known for its height and impressive structure. Climbing the stiff steps is worth it for the amazing views. So right now we will uh, moving around for our lunch. Eating lunch. Gate or that gate where the people, when they die inside the capital city, they will bring their hope through this gate, outside of this gate. So they're not allowed to be a cremation inside the capital city, just only for the royal family. Uh, this one is the pile we were used for building the house in the old time for the local people during the Uncle period. That lock, we have the extra uh, wooden door in other side. When the enemy coming in, they cannot see us from the top of the wall. That's why we call it deadlock. Whenever they come in, they get killed. This gate is significant for its historical rule in rituals and traditions. It offers a glimpse into the ancient practice of the Khmer Empire, a quiet and historical spot away from the main temple areas. Yeah, this place feels a bit serious. Time for something lighter. Victory Gate is the gate where the king will use this gate for getting victory over the enemy. And then they will come in through this gate. The gate symbolizes triumph and celebration. It's a great spot for walking and taking photos. The surroundings have a lively and victorious feel, perfect for capturing the spirit of success and history. Feeling more relaxed? Let's find a quiet place 
to soak in some serenity. Prasad Palelai is the Buddhist temple that hidden in the Roya Palace of Angkor Thom. Palelai Temple is a small Buddhist temple surrounding by trees. It's hidden away from the main parts. You cannot climb the temple due to the overgrown tree roots. The site is a perfect example of how nature reclaims man-made structures. It's a peaceful and serene spot, ideal for reflection and meditation. This temple offers a unique blend of spirituality and nature. Let's go somewhere peaceful next. Srah Srai. And the other one, we have uh, the small one behind here is the Srah Pro. Srah Srai is for the female, for the lady in waiting, and the people who serve the service in the Royal Palace. Meet me and Aga Temple, located in the center of the Royal Palace. The temple is linked to the legend of the nine headed Naga. According to the legend, the king meet the serpent spirit to sexual prosperity for the kingdom. Ancient tiles in shades of brown, black, and white can still be seen. The temple's unique architecture and mystical stories add to its mystique. It offers a glimpse into the spiritual and ceremonial practice of the Khmer Empire. Speaking of stories, let's see a really famous temple. The biggest jigsaw in the world Bapun Temple were used 300,000 stone to build the reclining Buddha. Bapun Temple features a massive reclining Buddha made from 300,000 stones. Originally, the central tower was guarded in gold, showcasing the grandeur of the Khmer Empire, known as Cambodian's largest parcel due to its complex restoration. The temple is centrally located in the Royal Palace area. It stands as a testament to the architecture skill and ambition of the ancient Khmer. Take time to appreciate the monumental scale and intricate craftsmanship. Time for the last stop, the famous smiling face. Bayon Temple during the golden light time at 4.15. It's beautiful and less crowded. Granite system. The most important gallery in Cambodia is here too. Uh, this one is automatic crossbow that charms scare the most. Uh, each time they can shoot in for five of them. In the ancient time, we have bamboo bridge, stone bridge, and wooden bridge. Or the bamboo bridge is the fighting technique. So later on, they can cut it and the people will not able to use or cross the bridge anymore. Bayuan Temple is famous for its 54 towers adorned with smiling faces. Each tower features four faces symbolizing the Bodhisattva Alokeshvara. The temple is stunning during the golden hour. Intricate carvings depict scent of everyday life, barrels and market of the Khmer people. These carvings provide a vivid glimpse into ancient Cambodian society. Bayon Temple is a must visit for the unique blend of art history and history. What's a day? Let's wrap this up. From the peaceful start at Taprom to the iconic smiles at Bayon. It's a day filled with history and beauty. Tailor your tour to fit your star and make sure to suck in every moment, you are left with great memories and a deeper appreciation for Cambodians' rich heritage. That's all the way how you spend one day at a temple like the bro. I hope you get a lot about this.